Hello Foxy Sharks, welcome back to my channel En el día de hoy les voy a hablar de una de mis obsesiones Honestly, it's like my biggest obsession there is And it's Bath and Body Works I love Bath and Body for their splashes and for their creams and everything, even the candles Right now, um, the, the vast majority of the splashes and the creams that I bought in this little haul are from the holiday collection and from the holiday collection I love 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 two of them like my ultimate favorite and that are like always in my top 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 five are winter candy apple and vanilla bin noel winter candy apple is that smell like winter candy apple is Sharon you say winter candy apple you think of Sharon you say Sharon you think of winter candy apple I have so many different bottles or packaging of the same winter candy apple throughout the years because I never want to run out of it like I can't stay without the smell of winter candy apple and I know this sounds very first world issues but I just can't stay without winter candy apple period so this is the smell this is the the bottle like from two years ago i think this was actually a gift i had like a secret santa and one of my friends from the office he was like the only thing that i could think about by buying you and that i knew that you will actually enjoy so he was like winter candy apple and when i saw this i was completely elated i totally think that i had the best gift of them all mm, so good you can smell it from outside the bottle then I also have this other packaging. This is the packaging of last year, if I'm not mistaken. And I think this one is still in stores because if it doesn't get sold out, they will just put it in store as well. Then this one is from two years ago. This one is, oh, whoops. <laughs> Great, son los bloopers. <laughs> this one is like two years ago and um, it's almost like around here it's almost finishing I, I think this is the one that I'm gonna continue using because I don't need that much <laughs> that's a lie <laughs> and um, the new one from this year because they changed the packaging if I could find it, it will be awesome okay <laughs> Oh, it's right here. <laughs> I couldn't see it. You see how many is there? It's it, it, because they changed the color. They put it green. Wow. I don't know how I'm feeling about this packaging though, about them body. Put it red. Put it red again. Red packaging. What's wrong with you? The only thing that I must say is that throughout the years, me that I'm a connoisseur of the smell, is that, um, the smell is going to be, it's going faint every single year. And this one, okay, we're gonna try it. I can put literally all of the smells on, on top of me right now and I will not get like sick or clyde. Oh, it's like a meat, but mm, winter candy apple. It's not as strong as let's say this one and you guys may say, okay, it's totally strong, the, the old ones because you have them from other years, but no, this will smell a mile away even if it was the new one I also got the splash the splash is something that I usually use throughout the year and that does like end for me that I finish it completely so good so so good you know what is to smell like Christmas throughout the year the best time of the year but well continuing with the holidays another like a scent that I got into since last year is the twisted peppermint scent and this year i got the splash because it's so good i'm gonna so good mm. i tell you miss vanilla ben noel is my signature smell when I used to be in the office, I need to go back to the office. I know I'm, I, I, I miss it. At some point I do miss it because I have my colleagues, I have my friends there. I will walk around and everybody will be like, mmm, you smell like candy, you smell like cookies, you smell so, so sweet. Vanilla Ben Noel, this is the secret, you guys. Um, anytime I used to put this on, whoops. Hi, yeah, you can call that. Wow, okay, that's what you get by not 
using the cream for months. Wow, I need to shake that. But she gets good because the thing is that this vanilla bean oil, she has a lot of like oils. As you can see, the components are fresh vanilla bean, sugar cookies, warm caramel, warm caramel, whipped cream, and snow kiss musk. The musk is the reason why it stays so long on the skin. But if you see, I it was waterish, and I would just rub it on myself. Um, I can never get enough of it. Never ever get enough of Vanilla Bean Noel. And I discovered this thanks to my Tia Carmen. I gotta give her a shout out. She gave me this as a, as a gift for Christmas. And then since then, I haven't been able to stop by. It's just crazy. And due to the fact that I'm so obsessed with Vanilla Bean Noel, this year I had to get the candle. Because I just can't get enough of it. And what is life without a scented candle, right? So good. If you guys could smell it. If you guys could smell it. I feel today right now like a cooking channel. When you're talking about like, oh, oh the food is so good. Well, this, mm, this is the smell. I got this new candle over here as well. Because um, I wanted, they had them on sale. And I love candles. And this is also a Christmas candle. It's called Calm and Bright Twisted Peppermint. Give me a break. This is so so good i should turn it on for you guys and let's get into this let's turn this on right oh god the ghetto i will not see this is the matches that i have i literally the last one oops <laughs> such a mess mm -mm. beautiful I'm just gonna leave it here so that it gets more acquainted. My favorite, favorite, like ultimate, ultimate, ultimate favorite, it's called Velvet Sugar. The Velvet Sugar is everything you want and more. It's like literally putting red velvet cake on your body, but like with so much sugar on it. And I totally, totally love this. Because I don't want it to end. And this is one of the retired fragrances. They don't sell this anymore. <laughs> they don't sell this anymore in stores. Moving on. So we had to take a little break because um, my recording device was losing battery speed of light. Okay, this candle right here smells so good already. It has all the room. Mm. This cream over here, this hot cocoa and cream when i saw it i was like oh let me just taste a little um, a new something a little look of something new this is so good <laughs> like you honestly want to eat it it's literally like drinking a cup of cocoa like so so good with marshmallows on it it this one actually only has creamy notes of cocoa mini marshmallows and vanilla musk i mean food Period. There's nothing more. It's really, really good. I love that one. But I wanted to talk to you guys about A Thousand Wishes. Male. Oh, she knows that I love Bath and Body. And for one of my birthdays, she was like, "Oh no, I didn't know. I didn't know what smell you were gonna actually like and stuff." So she actually bought me this one. And since then. Is one of my signature smells usually whenever we had like secret Santa's or something I'll always tell them a thousand wishes why because I know for a fact that a thousand wishes is always in stores and it's good how crazy am I this has nothing to do with Christmas of all the smells that I smell already but a thousand wishes so good it's such a feminine scent it's like Anywhere that you will pass, walking around, smelling like a thousand wishes, whoever knows the smell will know that you smell of it, and literally everybody's gonna be fanning over you. I don't even understand why I'm single. I'm always smelling good, but well, whatever. Moving on, this is not about that. Okay. Uh, I need to talk about, we're talking about ending the year on the good foot, right? The best, best, best into the night. Last year, Christmas, my aunt came from the States 
I know I, you see why I love Bath and Body because it's ba it ba basically like I have a connection to it with friends, family. It's like a tradition, you know. My aunt, she they went to buy all these gifts for all the nieces and all the nephews and everything. And she was like, okay, so you are gonna be the first one to choose one because you're staying here with me. And I was like, I've never smelled this one of Into the Night. Let me just go ahead and try it out. And she gave me the cream and she also gave me the body mist. Oh my God, when I tell you guys that this is the best way to receive the new year, so, so good. It's like a feminine but mature, but at the same time, playful smell I mean into the night it's, it's that big Tyler. I mean I have nothing else to say into the night period get it have it in your basket anything own it and this year they also had another sale because <laughs> you know I'm a sales girl because you, uh, you already you guys already know that my aesthetic is that I take advantage of the sales I got the body mist but with the diamonds you gotta sparkle you need to sparkle honey and oh also Bath and Body every year they have their smells for the summer because you know that you're not gonna be using a into the night plain June that you guys have summer over there in the States or even for us like January February that we have our summer you're not supposed to be using this milk I myself will use it because I'm obsessed with smelling differently and the other thing is that I don't use only one scent I splash myself like with five different scents per day Waikiki Beach is the scent that I want to talk to you guys about like when I tell you this is the, if you're into coconut, if you're into beach, if you want to feel the skin, your skin to like to be in the beach, that you want to feel the sand and everything, this is the smell for you, honey. This is it. Waikiki bitch is so, so good. Like literally, I will sp spray this on me like on top of me completely and it's so, so good. It, like it's the perfect beach scent. And you know how I discovered this one? A colleague that used to sit in my same row at my office, she was like, have you tried Waikiki Beach? I was like, no, not really. She was like, you need to, you, you that are obsessed, because not that you that like it, because I'm I, I'm way past liking, I'm obsessed with Bath & Body. You should try Waikiki Beach. When I tell you guys that I haven't been able to stop buying Waikiki Beach since then, I have one of these, and it's like around here, but I had to take advantage and take the other one because I don't want it to end. You know when you buy something and you don't want it to end? It's, this is like cheese for me. This is like rice, sugar, food stuff. Why am I comparing food to splashes? Not me comparing food to splashes. But well, Waikiki Beach is your summer, your sunny day vibes smell. So, 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 so good. But always there's something bad to all of it. Oh no. I'm not gonna lie to you guys and tell you that all the smells that I have tasted throughout the years are good. This? No. Deceased. Like, you guys want, this is a retired scent. Retire it forever. Like, stop producing it. We don't need it. It's not need. When I tell you that this is disgusting, I mean, it's almost done. I'm not gonna say disgusting, that's too harsh. When I tell you that it's sickening, but sickening not in a good way, because you guys know that I like to say sickening. No, it's sickening, like it, it te enferma. You get sick out of smelling like this. I used to use it on my legs only, because I was like, you know something, if, if I'm not gonna be able to tolerate it on my hands, let's try to use it for my feet. I'll, it's so strong. I, you can't they get away from the smell. It's terrible. And the thing is that whenever I used to use it at the office, because I will put it outside, because all my colleagues will come to my chair and take from my creams and everything. I'm like, you guys, this is an investment, you know. I buy it, but I buy it because I like to smell good, not because I want to share with the world. I'm not a mean person, just so you know, I don't want to get canceled. I'm not selfish. But it's the way that there were, uh, some of them were taking way too much. <laughs> way too much every day. So, I took the executive decision <laughs> of my inventory 
to put this one outside so that they could use it. You know something? I actually had to retire it from that as well. Because they will come to my seat again and I will smell it. And I was like, you know something? Life is too short for me to keep smelling this. So I retire it. Why do I still have it? I don't know. And okay, I do know why. We were sent home and I had it in my locker and I had to go get all my stuff like three weeks ago and that's the reason why I got it again. And then I smelled, I was like, let me see if I can still talk, mm -mm. I still can't, we'll never will. Bye. So the last thing that I have over here is this candle called Mary Cookie. Oh my God, oh my God. This is, this smells beautiful. I'm not gonna turn it on. I'm not gonna light it up. I can turn it on. I'm not gonna light it up, but it's really, really good. I mean, all the candles of Bath & Body are beautiful. I think from the, co the, cucumber, the cucumber, I could tolerate the, I think I could tolerate the, the candle, but I don't think so either because that's gonna be all over this, Let's not talk about the cucumber melon anymore. She's down, she's deceased. She has been banished from this house. And well, oh my God, thank you guys for staying all the way and going with me through all of this obsession. I'm gonna stay over here, smelling beautifully, smelling good for myself, my mom, and nobody else here in my house. <laughs> throughout this quarantine and I hope you guys get yourselves some bath and body get yourself some smells there's nothing better than smelling good for yourself because so, just so you know I smell good for myself then the world and all the way over here please remember to subscribe remember to like this video and also to turn on the bell notifications so that you can get more amazing content coming your way if you have a favorite smell from Bath & Body, please leave it in the comments because I would like to have a conversation with you. Have a nice day, Fussy Shark. Bye-bye. See you in the next one. Oh, yeah. Like candy. O sea, the best. Oh, so good. Mm.